Nice to meet you. I'm your local legislator, Representative Plourd. I just wanted to say hello and hope I can get your vote this November. Have you uh, got any issues of concern? Christ, I got issues. Taxes are too goddamn high. Weather's too friggin' hot. And the wife's been friggin' nagging me all friggin' day. Toxic waste? What are you friggin' numb? For Christ's sake, this junk's been collecting in my basement for 15 years now. Do I look like a friggin' mutant? What the fuck am I supposed to do with it now? Fuck if I know. It ain't paint recycling day. Make a friggin' art sculpture for all I friggin' care. So then I come home from work and I find a mailbox knocked down. Driveway all ratted up. Garage door right stove the fuck in and a big old empty bottle of bitch whiskey sitting on the front step. Finally, I just says to my mom, I says, I ain't taking you on no more Sunday rides to the mainland if you don't smatten up. Great to meet you. Excuse me. Hey there, buddy. How you doing? I'm Representative Plourd, your local legend. Yeah, I know who you are. What the fuck you doing all the way out here? Fucking... Kissing hands and shaking babies. You running for re-election or something? Well, yes. This is also a good chance to reconnect with constituents and find out if you've got any issues. Christ, everyone on this friggin' island thinks I've got issues. Representative, my name's Green Bud Kelly, and I've got an economic development proposal for you. Shoot away. Senator, regulations are destroying the opportunity for the little guy to survive. See, I'm a contractor, and I've got some work, but I'm being smothered to death by government meddling. What's the problem? Well, I got a rock wall job, and I got some rocks to haul, but I got a bad back, and I need my truck. Now the government's telling me I can't take her on the road. I can employ some locals, create some good-paying jobs, hell, even bring in some more tax revenue to the state. <sighs> Senator, if you could find the time to visit my humble little workshop, I could explain everything. Now, as you can see, I wasn't fucking you. My business is legit. Over here, we got my office. And over there, we got the employee lounge. Now, hold on. Here comes one of my workers now. Hey, Adam, you finished the pucker brush out back? Yeah, I uh, hit a yellow jacket nest in the process. Yep, gotta watch out for them, chummy. Here, go rub some jewel weed on yourself and toss a few bags of cement in the pickup when you get a chance. After that, I need you to shovel out the chicken house. You see that, Senator? <laughs> well, you know as well as I do that it's been hard times out here for working folk. But if you could help me cut some regs, I could give a fighting chance to five more just like that kid. Is that the truck there? No, 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 no. This is the truck! She's beautiful. Ain't she? Yep, old bitch has got a big old bone 468 with some nitrous for big power. She's sitting on some 44-inch boggers and ready to get after it. Oh, but they've penned her in just because she got a little lift on her. Can you fucking believe it? Oh. Hmm. Do you happen to uh, also uh, take her muddin'? Hell yeah, guy! You get where I'm coming from, don't you? This is our heritage. It's our culture. Shit you put in a bill to protect our rights, we'll get every four-wheel club in the state up to a guster. Them goddamn pony-headed road bureaucrats won't know what hit them. <laughs> well, shit, maybe you want to see how she handles. I could lay down a couple of J-strips and rollbacks for you. Wouldn't be nothing, really.
Well, I, I don't know. Oh, we'll just give her a little bit of... Oh. Hey, Adam! Get the fuck over here and lock the hubs! You should get a load of her when I tack her up at Dampa. Oh, no, that's fine. I, uh... Oh, we'll just give you a little smoke show. Oh, gosh, I... Well, friggin' A! Give her the fucking dinner! Put the corn to her! Mocha tire guy! Mocha fucking peace patch! <laughs> Looks like you've been doing a bit of gear shifting over here. <laughs> yep, the old leech field's really been taking a beating. It's been mighty soft after the spring rain, and I've been getting her all fucking mired up. Had to twitch her out yesterday. That reminds me. Hey, Adam! Make sure you fill in them crevices when you're done. What the hell is going on here? Hmm, I, I, I didn't think you'd take it on the road. Roads? <laughs> Are you sure this is legal? No, sure! We're just taking a shortcut to get down to the gravel pit so we can sling a little mud. Well... Oh, relax. She's posy. Besides, she's wicked rugged. She can take it. Ah. <laughs> Friggin' Stady! Trooper Trahan, you big dumb cunt! How the fuck are ya? Bud, there are so many things about this vehicle that are out of compliance that if you don't get her off the road, in the next five minutes, and park it. I'm going to have the boys from headquarters come down and dismantle her on the spot. Do you understand me? All right, will do. Bud, have you got a buzz on? Fuck no, I'm sober as a fucking judge. Can't you tell? Well, what's that down there? <laughs> oh, that's just my spittoon. <laughs> Hmm. Park it. Now. I don't know why he always has to be such a friggin' dink all the time. And by the way, Senator, if you're looking to save some money in the next budget, I could think of a good place to cut. <laughs> I'm dead broke, but I'm having a blast. I got a pack of full flavors and a gallon of gas. Cooler beers and a belly of grub. And I'm popping the top and I'm locking the hub. And it's the skunk. 